I just need a tight vagina. So I think what we should do is um, <clears throat> insert a penis in here. <laughs> Good morning and welcome to another a beautiful and exciting and hopefully illness free week on John Vlogs. <laughs> I'm going to go and take the garage because these three days, believe it or not, it's been last week I was sick a lot if you saw that episode, a lot. I was sick for three days, very, very ill. I'm still not great. However, I have to get stuff done. And one of the things I have to get done is to get my MOT done, which is always incredibly exciting. My MOT's run out, my taxes run out, all my emails are down because they didn't get paid. My two credit card um, um, bills are due. Oh, which, you know, anyway, and then there's messages from customers. There's a website which has to go up, obviously. There's so much happening. It's too much for my little brain to process. My mum sent the cards through, so these are the cards we're gonna sell, all the money's going to charity. Cause I thought I'd been, cause she does this stuff, you know? Um, she's got like lots of different styles, all handmade. She just likes doing it, you know? Anyway, there's a few cards there. And she sent the logo down, it's all here, but I just tried to call her because I think I need to cut it out. Um, but I haven't got time to do it. This is this is the issue what I've got. Where are my keys? So I haven't got time to do it. <clears throat> um, yeah, so I'm just gonna have to, I don't know, cause I've got to do the website today, you know. I'm just looking in here, it does actually look good in here. And I'm kind of pleased, sorry, I don't spend a lot of time down here at the moment, but you know, that will change. Oh, look at that, it looks like I've, I'm looking like I'm Dr. Scaramanga there with my third nipple. It's not, it's a spot when he's squeezing. I've done the website, did it. Late day, it's like 13, 14 hours. You know, it's a lot of work, what I've, a lot of time, but I need to make up for the time. I've got Friday, Saturday and Sunday, and maybe they're the three days what I've lost. Um, and I should be like back onto schedule. There was a few problems with the logo which my mum made, so she's correcting it all. I know you're so excited about me sticking my needles in people, and I don't blame you. Don't blame you. Look at that face. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. No tongs, no tongs. You've never seen as much. Stop jumping up. Crap, at the back of there, I used Dama's new Shark, not promoting Shark or anything, but it was actually quite a good Hoover. Shark wired Hoover. Um, and she went around the back um, and we got all the crap up and it feels a bit cleaner in here. Millie was sick, a massive pile of sick at the side of the bed. So I've had to wash the rugs at the side. A bit of a pain. Um, and guess who's not very well today? That's right, Dal Mushka. So she's at home and she's gonna be just chilling at home, trying to get better. Um, she's not as bad as me, I was crap. And I'm gonna make a mushroom omelet. I'm gonna dump all the contents into the egg. It's gonna get nice and mixed up. Breakfast. <laughs> Enjoy. It's like an omelette pizza. It's like an omelette cake. <laughs> <It's nice. laughs> Weird day today. I'm. I'm gonna. I, I, I can't do anything. Everything's come to a standstill. I can't do the vlog for you. So it's come late by two days again. Because it's anyway. There's lots of problems. I have made some orders. Stock. Anyway, I'm gonna go into the clinic and I'm gonna put the sign up, I'll put part of the sign up, which my mum did. She looks okay down there. So I said my mum's fixing a couple of teas and the logo as well. The thing is that the logo is too small. It's 
so it's just not gonna look right. I mean, maybe I can put it on somewhere, um, but anyway, I'm gonna put it on the wall. <clears throat> I'm just gonna put it on the wall and then um, just to see how it looks. Did I try it? I'm a bit nervous. <laughs> Bloody brilliant. I mean, my mum did all that, you know, how cool is that? It's reflecting, it's got the lines, on, I mean, it's got the gradient on, so good. And the hard thing now is to, because I've got the word aesthetics. Now, <clears throat> I'm gonna have to stagger the letters, so I'm gonna have to make them more. I'm literally gonna have to, this is gonna be an interesting one. I'm gonna have to put a line underneath and then mark what each one of the letters is gonna go so it goes all the way across perfectly. <laughs> How's my math? Signs up. It's done. So we're ready for business, more or less. I've got to get this marketing sorted, as I said, but you know, down here's done. I've ordered a few more needles, a little bit more stock, um, but more or less, I'm good to go. But there is one major problem. You won't know this. <clears throat> it's freezing. And this heater here, all it does is flash and flash and the heat what comes out is minimal so i'm not sure is it working i don't think so because it's so low i really do like setting up businesses and i'm good at it and i can do it quickly but you know i mean this aesthetics thing once i start and i get into it that's going to be my life, you know. So much to learn, so much to learn. New products, new techniques. There's all sorts of beauty shows where I can go to. And then, and so I kind of want to get past this and actually have a regular client base. So look how my cheeks are hanging there. I just think, I just need this pulled back. Even though I had threads, I, I just think this is age. Or is it fat? Maybe work if I find my aquatics here to dissolve this fat. <clears throat> Saturday I'm having this lovely appetizing breakfast you can actually uh, there's a hole in the roof just there. I think what I might do I might go up to the <laughs> roof and plaster it with my porridge. It's fucking disgusting. Wish this cold would go. I think it's going to last for a while. I mean, Dalma's like sneezing and blowing her nose and feeling like crap. And I am still, you know, it's just not, it doesn't seem to be shaking off. I mean, I'm not bad. You know, I'm still alive and amazingly good looking. So what more could you possibly want than to be me? Hey. Whoa. <laughs> I'm sorry swallowed some snot. So we're gonna go by, I have to edit now. <laughs> oh, you know, I can't wait until like all this, you know, all this prep's done because then I can focus on myself again. It's like eating terribly just to save a bit of time. Went into the shop, I just grabbed a, a pasty and his vegetarian thing, which I just scoffed down, um, and a tart. <laughs> but now I'm gonna buy some paint. I was actually down in the salon now, doing some paint and cleaning up and doing more, you know, little bits. Nobody will ever be able to tell what I've done. It's just the devil is in the detail, in my understanding. I know people don't care um, necessarily if they get a good job, but it bothers me and I think I remember when I've been to some clinics, okay, and it's tatty and they haven't thought about the client's experience and I've th I just find it very important. Am I doing overkill? Maybe I am. I'm still going to do it. I'm still painting. I'm just trying to get as much done as I can. And I'm going to do the stairs now. That's what I'm going to paint for. And I'm going to do them dark. 
Um, but not all dark. I'm actually going to do white and well, like a grey colour underneath there. Um, oh, it's a lot of water. <laughs> um, and then on the top, I'm going to do it dark as you walk down. Then see how it is. If it's okay, then I will probably. Then what I'll probably do is um, make a little white stripe at the side of the steps if it needs it. It might not even need it, but let me just prep these stairs. Dalma was expecting me to make food. Not tonight, Satan. Not tonight. Just on the stairs. I didn't show you because it's such a fucking mess. It took me ages to do it. What time is it? Oh, my watch is dead. Um, anyway, so I've done the stairs and they look a mess. I'll show you tomorrow, but I have to do them again. Didn't take, I didn't rub down the stairs and I think it was oil based, which was on before. And I'm putting plastic based on, <laughs> water based. Whatever it is. I've got a headache. I've been sat in those fumes, massive headache. I thought I opened it. Hang on. Let me open the. It was open. No, it wasn't. I just opened it. We're going to go shopping. This is a right panic attack. I'm like, I'll go do this, I'll go do that, the other. And it's like, John, just slow down. And if I was giving advice to my own clients, I would do it in a certain way. And I was, I was like thinking, I've got to do that first. And now I know what I'm going to do. And that is, um, Dalma and I are going to go to the clinic. I'm going to make love to Dalma so that she has some nice blonde gay babies inside her. <laughs> and then that's it. <laughs> that's all we're gonna do. <laughs> Sorry, Dalma. <laughs> it's all right, you got, you got about one more, uh, about one more inch. Well done. Come on, fatty, get out. <laughs> enjoys me taking videos of her and she said please just record another quick video in the car didn't you Dalma? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> I will miss that. When I'm gone. One day. <laughs> so we'll be filming for another year maybe. You know seriously if, if this yeah. mortgage doesn't come through the possibility that it won't go through. Seriously it's that lay that the mortgage might have um, elapsed. So she might be with me even longer. So lots more videos of me and Dalma together. <laughs> Are you really not Let's see. I'm, I'm, it is quite shocking. You know, it is shocking how long it's taken. I'm actually making two dishes. I'm, um, I'm doing chili con carne in one pan and I'm preparing onions in another. If you want to make courgette soup, I don't know if you've ever heard of it, I've tried it. It's a very simple recipe. Um, and this recipe I actually learned from one of my exes, Frank, from Spain. And it's absolutely gorgeous, so easy to do it. It's kind of like courgette, um, onions, garlic, and then cheese triangles. You can blend it with cheese triangles and it's delicious. Anyway, I'm going to do these meals because I should have cooked for Dharma yesterday, but I was busy. I'm running out of money, desperately, for all the stuff which I need to do, but at least I have food. The dogs have their food. I've got my house. I've got my heat. You know, what else could I want? You know? I want a lot more. I want so much more. Oh, micro needle, bitch. I think it's going to come to mine as well. Oh, yeah. well, oh yes. Yeah, but you want to see, I mean, if you look how ugly she is now, and then you can see. <laughs> this, is, this is the before. No, <laughs> um, yeah, we've done, we done everything. We've done really well. We've got the um, food. 
bought, we've, I've made the food, I'm sorry I didn't show you, I'm just really busy. Um, I ain't got time for you all the time. Huh? For me. Things will calm down, you know, and I'll more exciting stuff. Like send me and Dalma having sex, that's exciting. I'm gonna push out a sex tape, you know, gay and Hungarian. I think that's what Pamela Anderson did, didn't she? <laughs> Oh, hi Daniel, what are you doing? Are you putting on your, are you putting on your moisturizer? Yeah. You look beautiful. Right, it's good. <laughs> oh, okay. Horrible steps. These are the steps what I'm telling you about. What a mess. But another coat and they'll be okay. I've done that micro, I didn't show you, you know, you're gonna get bored of me showing your micro needling all the time, but, you know, she was like, eh, you're gonna hit me. I'm like, no, because last time she was saying, I can't see any results. I'm like, this has been one month, you gotta keep doing it. So I'm pushing it to get no, it done no, more no. often. I'm pretty sure this is how it should be. You have this treatment, yeah. and after the see results, so that's why you want again. Yeah, but the, no, it's true. No? Yeah, it's true. But the first time I was like doing it so light on her, just so she wasn't freaked out. <laughs> but like even like now, you can see on my face is like plumped up. I still have to paint tonight, but I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna watch a film and relax because I'm, I can't keep doing this. Oh yeah, this is popped up. <laughs> Just need to relax. I've got a plan. You'll see my plan unfold. And the next thing is that I've got to do a photo shoot and video shoot downstairs. Because if I send out the newsletters and people see the website, where are my images? Where are the images of the shop, the salon? I haven't put them on there. I haven't taken them, so I'm waiting to, Finish off the painting today. Get all the um, get all the logos and everything up there. I'm gonna arrange a bit of a photo shoot. I need something to do the photography. How cool. Daniel? Maybe is he reliable? Crouton. Oh, croutons. Yeah. yeah. I was supposed to be at the, the clinic painting. It didn't happen. Fell asleep. And it's late now. I'm do. I'll do it tomorrow. I feel guilty. Beautiful day. Absolutely stunning. Got to get this company moving quick. I'm steady, steady, steady. I just, um, we pay quite a lot of money in summer, so it likes being in summer, so we were actually in credit with the gas and the electricity, but then now, I just let it elapse for a little while and it was a lot of money. But I just had to pay, I had to put it on my credit card. Really, really disturbing. It's like I understand how people are struggling terribly. Um, I think my, most importantly, I just need to get some money now because everything's come to a grind and halt, you know? All this preparation, losing money. <laughs> I guess I'm not putting any effort into anything else, but it's all good, it's all good. Millie has absolutely destroyed this jacket. She's been jumping up. She's got this game where she jumps and jumps and jumps. So much so that she's ripping my jacket. Anyway, so I have to pick her up and put her back down again. I, I, I'm, she's picked up for like 20 seconds and that's it. And then she's happy. But it's a bad habit she's getting into. Back working on these stairs. And you know, it's really important because um, <laughs> it's really important the way I do it at the moment. I'm doing the edges. Um, and I'm doing the sides and I'm doing the back. The reason why I'm doing it like that is because um, the shop's not, the um, the barber's shop isn't closed yet. Um, but I'm waiting for Ash to come because Danny, the other barber, he's gone on holiday now, so he's gone to the airport. But Ash is gone, and gosh, is clumsy. So Ash will have to make sure he stands just on the middle of the steps until it dries. And then when he goes, I'll paint the rest of the step, you know? But I thought if I do it this way, then it'll be a little bit more, I don't know, better with my time. So look at those black stairs already drying. And they do look great. And I had some left over. Actually, I think I might have tried some more and I got a bit carried away. So on the outside, um, I've taken see it's still shining. So I gave this a little coat. Because whoever did it before did such a bad job. 
And what I'd really like to do is get another colour and then paint the floor maybe black. I think black and then the back black or something like that. Obviously change these plants and then just tart it up. You see I didn't do around this side because I need a tiny little bit left for the steps, which is more important. But if Ash buys it, you know, if Ash buys the paint for here, I'll sweep it down and paint the floor as well when <laughs> it's closed. Now I think it'll look great, I really do. I need to do some white paint white as well. Look at the back of these steps. If you look down there, whoever did this before got paint everywhere. And even when I go around here, you can see, how did they get it up the back of the wall, up the wood? It's ridiculous. Not good. I would not be personally happy with that at all. But anyway, done until tomorrow. <laughs> All that paint last night, what I put on the bench when I left it, it's still wet. Um, anyway, so um, I went round, spoke to Ash, and um, because I ran out of paint, so I'm gonna get some more paint today. I'm gonna do the front of the building. I'm getting crazy, but I just want, you know, the front of the building as well as downstairs and the shared area, all to be as nice as possible. Um, so I've got, on, I've got a lot on today, um, more paint in more prepping but you know again exciting i'm sorry i just find it exciting and it's basically because we've got the photo shoot tomorrow so hopefully i can finish the hopefully i can get all this painting done early um yeah that's a good point actually hopefully i can get all the painting done reasonably early because i really have to Make sure that it's okay for the photo shoot tomorrow. It needs to be dry for tomorrow. Foggy, in it. Oh crap! Every time I go to Leyland, there's always some parking outside, and then now I'm having to. I'm literally looking over the road down there at Leyland, and there's no parking. You know, where am I going to park? A bit annoying. Sorry, you come round, thanks. But I'm kind of having to stick out my nose out of the street to see if any cars move. Can I park here? Actually, maybe I can just park. Fuck it, I'm gonna have to park. I have no choice. Oh, God, that's right. Problem is, it's like, oh, I need a shit as well. Again! I'm gonna hear something interesting. When I went to go and get the paint, they messed up. And um, I um, I had to put some more money on the meter. So um, I was like, and everybody was really tense and it was weird in this place. Anyway, so um, this guy, he was very, very nice with me. Um, and he says, can I help you with anything you want? Anyway, I was like trying a bit of attention. So I went over and I got a little packet of, um, things, whatever, um, I don't know, like little washers or something like that. And I just threw them on the floor and I went, me. And he said, you're right. And I was like, yeah, said, um, and I thought that he would kind of like pick up on it. Cause the way I looked at it, I pulled a funny face in that. Anyway, he did not find it amusing at all. So I was like, he was like, you're all right, mate. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? So boring, some people. He wanted to stay in that bubble of misery. And that's fine if he wants to be there, you know, and ugh, just so boring, I hate that shit. People, maybe I've just got a weird, really weird sense of humor. I actually believe, uh, maybe I do, or maybe he had a weird sense of humor, but I'm maybe just didn't fucking have one. Cause some people don't. I, 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 I always have this idea, I think a lot of us do think that everybody should think the same as us and why don't they do that and that person should do that not the case you see every everybody's very very different and I've got to remember that <sighs> not all perfect like me <laughs> I thought I'd do a little bit of work outside so I painted the outside of the building <laughs> you know I just thought it might, maybe it'll look a bit nicer but look how fresh that looks now so I think I'm gonna go and paint all the way up you know do the whole thing as far as I can get through that way um, looks a lot cleaner and then the only problem is 
see, I'd like to paint this floor. I can't do it. It's got a bit difference there. That's the original. That's the new one, and that's the original. It was manky, but now it looks brand spanking new. But this floor, we can't do it because, uh, you know, it has to be at night when we finish work. And in addition to that, it's got to be a warm day. Evening, even. Thing is, it's like it all looks nice and fresh and everything, but you can't see Trusted Touch anywhere. It's like it's all about noble barbers, which is fine, you know. I'm, I'm very happy to have it like that, but I really need to get some advertising for noble barbers because otherwise, you know, what am I doing it for? But it looks cleaner anyway. What a beautiful day! And it's time for my photo shoot. Oh my god. The last time I had a photo shoot myself was when I was 20 and I was in London and somebody, I actually went round to help my friend Alan and he did some shoots for me because he was doing shoots of all the, um, all his friends and stuff, professional photographer, got some great photos, amazing, exciting really, I'm nervous because I don't come across very well on photos so I'm going to have to get directed, Daniel's going to come over. I'm very, very happy that Daniel's participating and Laurie, and she's going to be my mogul um, for the day. It's all good stuff. Laurie's a little bit late. Everywhere. Just doing the bit of cleaning. You leave for three hours. And Daniel said, by the way, Daniel and I are back together now, so Daniel's declared his undying love for me. And he said, I I'm so sorry for all the terrible he things said, which I've ever done for you. Didn't you just say that? Oh yeah, I'm sorry for all the good things I've done for you. <laughs> <laughs> I am <I'm> sorry. <laughs> At least he doesn't hate me anymore, which is I fine. Hate you, oh, he still hates me. <laughs> What's that again? I do hate you. Oh, there you go. I'm trying to help you. You're such a bastard. It's like I've done everything wrong. Oh. It's, well, it's true. No, he's a good boy. He's a good boy. Action. You should take a seat. I'll fix it. And tell me, because you have a beautiful face apart from these massive changes here. And action. So, Laurie, how are you feeling? Very good, very good. I'm going to feel more beautiful after oh, yeah, Dr. Yeah. John. Thank you very much. Inject yeah. something in my face. Yeah. Inject something in my vagina. <laughs> Two, three, action. So, I'm thinking, what are your concerns, first of all? Uh, I just need a tight vagina. <laughs> so, I think what we should do is um, <clears throat> insert a penis in here, and then, we, yeah, exactly. Yeah. And then we can make it stick out your throat just there. Mm -hmm. And once you've got sperm in the head, then you'll be able to do that perfectly. <laughs> I know. I think it'd be really cool. And then, what we can do, we can take your eyes, and pull them out, put them in a drink, and then drink them, maybe blend that them up or something like that. sounds amazing. I think so. So if you want, then we can take it on the bed, and oh. then we can get the plastic cock, and then just like so shoot it in your asshole. Ass. Yeah. So I'm thinking, okay, okay, this way, thank you. <laughs>
you've just seen the first video for Trusted Touch Aesthetics in Fulham, London. And I think it was okay. It's just a quick introduction. I am so tired. I think things are catching up on me, meaning... Anyway, I'll be okay tomorrow. I'm gonna go to Hawaii. But if you want to see that trip, which will never happen unless it's in my mind, tune in next week when I will see you at 6.30 on Thursday. Take care.